Hello guys, in this video we will be discussing the solutions for week 10 grade assignment of English subject. Let's begin. So here we have the first question. John has a friend dash daughter lives in the US. The correct option here is whose, right? So the explanation for this is uh, while writing we write it as friends friend apostrophe s friend's daughter while writing we write it, we write it like this right but here john has a friend we can't put s here john has a friend's daughter live, lives in this that won't be right so we use the word whose after the word friend right john has a friend whose daughter lives in the US. This word whose relates to friend, which means friend's daughter. John has a friend and the friends, the guy who is John's friend, his daughter lives in the US, right? So the second option here is the right option. Moving on to the second question. John was extremely happy dash his new car. The correct option here is about the explanation for this is uh, just think that one of your friend one of your friends come comes to you and uh, tells that John was extremely happy what question what question do you ask your friend then you would ask your friend John was extremely happy about what or John is extremely happy about what right about about what the answer is about his new car right so john was extremely happy about his new car the correct option here is about right so the second option here would be the correct option moving on to the third question so here so here we have the third question you must go through the answers dash the end of the book the correct option here is at so yeah when when your teacher says you must go through the answers at the end of the book that means the answers are the answers for all the questions available in the book the answers for all the questions uh, are, are available at the end of the book which means at the at the last pages some of the last pages have the answers for all the questions of the book right so at the end of the book would be the right option fourth question the traffic in the city was so heavy it took us two hours to drive dash it so the correct option here is through it right so why do we use the word through and why not on with and along through means surpassing by surpassing each and every vehicle stuck in the traffic right so let's say here there is a road and here there is another road right so all the cars here are waiting for like here there is a red light just think all the all the cars here are waiting for this red light to go green and yours and you are stuck somewhere here so we have to somehow surpass all these vehicles and move through and drive through this traffic right so we use the word through here right and not and not on with or along all right so option c is the correct option here moving on to the fifth question so we have the fifth question here you are the kindest person I know. In place of the word the, which of the following should be used? So here the word the, as we can see. So which, uh, so they are asking should we replace this word, this word with any of these. So the word next to the word the is kindest. So this is a superlative degree word, right? the word kind is the first degree so this is the first degree 
and the word kindest kindest is the second degree right so this is sorry so the word kindest right this is the second degree so this is a superlative degree and we have been taught that we have been taught that uh, before a superlative degree we have to use the article the right you are the kindest person i know right you are the kindest right and not most or a so this c option is the correct option the the article the itself should be used before the word kindest moving to the sixth question at mira's at mira's insistence he yielded dash their guest and gave up his room so let me just uh tell you guys what is what is the meaning of yielded here so yielded means to surrender or give up surrender or give up right so at mira's insistence let's say this guy he here is mira's son right so some guests have come to their residence so uh, mira who is the mom of this guy is saying him or is telling him to give up your room for the guest to relax so her son here he yielded or surrendered to their guest right the correct option here is two he surrendered to their guest and gave up his room right so the correct option here would be two right he surrendered to he yielded to right he yielded to their guest and gave up his room right let's move on to the seventh question so here we have the seventh question when when oh, sorry when he arrived when he arrived dash the station the train had already departed when he arrived dash the station the train had already already departed the correct option here is at and why don't we use to or in or anything else so here is the explanation for this answer here are the rule here are some of the rules for using arrive in or arrive at right so we when do we use arrive in we use arrive in for towns cities and countries and we use arrive at for buildings and parts of buildings right so station here is a part of a building right uh, parts of buildings for example bus stand railway station airport right these are parts of building so in such cases we use the word at and when when do we use arrive in we use arrive in when do, when like for example he arrived in london he arrived in europe right so we use arrive in for towns cities and countries and we use arrive at for buildings or parts of buildings or parts of buildings moving on to the eighth question iceland iceland is dash than spain so the correct option here is colder and why not coldest or more colder so more colder here just like doesn't make any sense we can say either colder colder which is which is what we have marked here or we can say more cold more cold colder itself means more cold right so either we use colder or either we use or we use more cold we can we should not be using more cold that doesn't make any sense right even coldest or cold here for this sentence doesn't make any sense colder is the right option here moving on to the moving on to the ninth question so here we have the ninth question 
turn right dash the first traffic lights then turn left so the correct option here is at turn right at the first traffic lights right and not on in or into so the, i think there is no need of an explanation for this turn right at the first traffic lights right turn right at the first traffic lights then turn left yeah that must be the answer tom is not sure that's the answer tom is not sure and if you try to ask a question tom is not sure if someone comes and tells you tom is not sure you would ask that person tom is not sure about what right so about here is the correct option and with that we end this uh, discussion thank you